In this video, we will try to solve another problem on Cournot duopoly model. The question was asked by a brother on EconMath's Telegram channel. The question is like this. Suppose Fatima and Zainab are Cournot duopolists. We have two firms in a duopoly. Okay. The demand is given by, this is the market demand, sorry, the industry demand, what you call, or we can also say this is the market demand where P is the price and Q is the total quantity sold. Fatima has a constant marginal cost of $30 and Zainab has a marginal cost of $60. How much is Fatima's output in equilibrium? We have to find the equilibrium output that uh, Fatima will produce. Okay. The options are given as 1600, 1200, 400 and 800. Okay. How to find uh, the solution to this question? So we have a corner duopoly model. In this case, we have um, different marginal costs. First, what we need to find, we need to find the reaction functions of both Fatima and uh, Zainab. Okay, how do we find the reaction function? Let us see. Okay, let me write it here like this. Uh, we have, let me write reaction function of uh, Fatima. Okay, Fatima. How to calculate this uh, reaction function? Now, uh, let me denote quantity produced by, I will write it here total revenue that Fatima will get is equal to price into quantity produced by Fatima. So Q subscript F denotes the quantity uh, produced by Fatima. Okay. So this is total revenue. Now what is P? P is being given us here. Okay. Let me write it also here. Our P is equal to 480 minus 0.2 q okay so i'm just writing it here this q denotes the total uh, output produced by both fatima and zena because we have only two uh, firms in the diopoly uh, diopoly sorry so this q is actually q f that means quantity produced by fatima uh, plus uh, q z so i'm just using the sub uh, subscripts for uh, fatima and zena here okay so total output is denoted by q okay so i can write in place of p i can write here 480 minus 0.2 in place of q we have this very thing that is qf uh, plus q z okay so this is total revenue actually this is the price inverse demand function to this we multiply qf okay so we have here 400 let me solve it again so we have 480 minus 0.2 qf this 0.2 is multiplied to each of these terms then we have again 0.2 qz and we have to multiply it with qf okay so this is actually 480 multiplying this qf to each of these terms so we have 480 qf uh, minus 0.2 2 qf qf same terms it can they can be uh, multiplied so we have uh, qf square okay minus 0.2 qf qz okay this is the total revenue function for fatima and what is marginal revenue for fatima marginal revenue for fatima is equal to the derivative of total revenue of fatima that is on trf upon d with uh, and taking derivative with respect to quantity produced by Fatima okay so taking derivative the derivative of a qf is 1 so we are left with 480 minus derivative of qf square is this 2 will become coefficient so 0.2 into 2 comes out to be 0 0.4 qf and exponent is subtracted by 1 2 minus 1 is 1 so this is qf minus derivative of qf is 1 so we are left with 0.2 q z here okay so this is the marginal revenue for fatima what is marginal cost marginal cost for fatima is being given as here so actually we are being given the fatima has a constant marginal cost of 30 so let me write it here 30 now profit maximization profit uh, maximization for fatima requires that marginal revenue should be equal to the marginal cost okay what is marginal revenue this very function let me write it here so we have 480 minus 0 0.4 qf uh, minus 0 0.2 qz and we equate it with the marginal cost which is 30 now we will 
try to solve it for qf okay so if we transpose this here so this will become 0 0.4 qf is equal to now 480 minus uh, 30 this comes out with 4 nothing she's all through that right so panza lot so we had so at panza okay then we have a minus 0 0.2 qz or if we divide this 0 0.4 to each of these terms what will it become so it is getting tedious here so if we divide this 0 0.4 to this 450 let us see what it becomes so we have 450 we have to divide it by 0 0.4 this can be written like this 450 upon 1 this 0 0.4 can be written as 4 upon 10 so if we transpose this will become like this we have 4 so um, what will happen then so we have 2 2 are 4 2 5 are 10 again we have 2 1 are 2 2 are 4 2 2 are 4 2 0 are 0 5 zeros are 0 5 2 are 8 5 2 are sorry 5 2 are 10 so one is left so 5 2 are 10 i hope this comes out to be let me do it again i am not able to do that this very correctly so 450 450 so this 0.4 when divided 0 0.4 will become 10 upon 4 so this is 10 upon 4 okay so this is 2 2 are 4 uh, 2 5 are 10 okay then we again we have 2 2 are 4 2 2 are 4 1 is left 2 5 are 10 5 5 are 25 5 2 are 10 11 12 5 2 are 10 11 12 i hope i make a the calculation now right so this will come out be 1 2 2 5 okay minus 0.2 upon 0.4 it will come out to be 0 0.5 qz okay this is very simple here now this is the reaction function this is the reaction function of Fatima and what does this it it simply tells us best response for Fatima okay in terms of output level decided by Zainab okay or simply reaction function of Fatima that is a reaction function of, of, of Fatima is the optimal quantity Fatima should produce given uh, Zainab has produced QZ okay so let us take the reaction function let this be equation first now we need to find the reaction function of Zainab same process will be applied here okay so first uh, I will write here a reaction function for Zainab Zainab will be found by first we need to find the total revenue for Zainab will be equal to price into quantity produced by Zainab that means what is price inverse demand function we have calculated uh, this year so we have this very thing so we have 480 480 minus 0.2 qf minus 0.2 qz to this we multiply uh, qz okay qz this is total revenue which comes out to be 480 uh, qz minus 0.2 qf qz minus 0.2 qz so here i am uh, multiplying this term to each of uh, this uh, qz to each of these terms so this becomes uh, okay now what is marginal revenue for fatima marginal revenue for zainab sorry is the derivative of total revenue for zainab with respect to the quantity produced by zainab that is qz so derivative of qz is 1 so we are left with 480 minus derivative of qz is again here 1 so we are left with 0 0.2 qf uh, similarly the derivative of q z square is 2 qz okay so we will this 2 into 0.2 comes out to be 0 0.4 q 
qz exponent is subtracted by 1 obviously what is marginal cost for zenob this is being given as a 60 okay now profit maximization will require we equate marginal revenue of zenob with it is with her marginal cost okay this is our marginal revenue so we have 480 minus 0.2 qf minus 0.4 qz should be equal to marginal cost that is 60 now solving for qz if i transpose this here this will become positive so we have 0.4 qz is equal to now so not a shit on all of share that dry store at the woo so we have charge of bees um then what we are left with we have minus 0.2 this very term q f okay now simply are uh, doing this calculation we have uh, 0.4 can be written as 4 upon 10 okay if we transpose this here so this will become let me write it here 420 upon 0.4 minus 0.2 upon 0.4 um, q f okay now doing this uh, tedious work again here so we have 420 uh, upon 1 this is 4 upon 10 so we have 420 upon 1 into 10 upon 4 transposing this will get reciprocated okay so this is 4 here okay so we have 4 ones are 4 4 4 zeros are 0 4 fives are 20 so we have 105 okay am i doing the calculation correctly or not yes i am doing the calculation correct okay let me rub this now okay so we have 105 in place of this that means uh, qz is equal to 1 0 5 0 minus this will come out to be 0 0.5 0 0.5 qf okay this is the reaction function for zenob okay it simply tells us uh, it simply tells us uh, or what we call the best response uh, function also it tells us the best response for uh, zenob in terms of the output level decided by fatima okay now this is our reaction function one reaction function two now let us solve them for how can we solve what was our question no i shall go question emotion how much is fatima's output in equilibrium so in equilibrium what we need to do we just need to plug this very reaction of zenob into the reaction function of Fatima okay so if we plug this value here so what will happen so quantity qf will be equal to we have 1 2 2 5 minus 0 0.5 what is qz qz is this 1 o 5 o minus 0 0.5 qf okay so doing this uh, messy calculation again so we have qf is equal to 1 2 2 5 minus now 0 0.5 means half what is half of 1 or 5 o? so we have uh, first uh, 2 5s are 10 2 2 are let me do it here so as cash dash at the panza cut us divide they say two five are ten uh should have pass uh two two are four I should have arc um two five are ten so this is for you two five okay so let me write here for you two five so minus into minus is plus now point five into point five comes out to be point zero point uh two five zero point five five is a 25 okay q f okay now transposing this term to lhs so we have q f 
माइनस जीरो पॉइंट टू फाइव क्यू एफ इज इक्वल टू वाल सर से बाशित पंचान वन टू टू फाइव माइनस फाइव टू फाइव वन टू टू फाइव माइनस फाइव टू फाइव पांच जीरो पांच से फाइव पांच ने पांच जीरो दो ने इज द जीरो बाह ने पांच तो सात सात और ना द कॉमा ओके वी हैव सेवन हंड्रेड सॉरी does it come out to be 700 now this comes out to be 500 um, 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 this is 0 0 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 this comes out to be 700 okay here I done the calculation uh, wrong somewhere 1225 why did I got this very value let me 1225 okay I am not able to so we have 1225 it should have been okay I am not sure uh, what uh, is the it should come out to be 600 okay i am not uh, able to remember this calculation here okay so it should have been actually uh, i have calculated it earlier it here come out to be 1125 okay so let me write here 1125 okay 1125 sorry for this mistake mistake 1125 so this will come out to be uh, 600 okay so if we uh, 1 minus 0 0.25 this comes out to be 0 0.75 qf is equal to 600 or qf is equal to now 75 uh, this comes out to be 600 into 0 0.75 can be written as 75 upon 100 this will become 100 upon 75 okay so this will come out to be uh, 15 what can we do here so we have five ones are five five fives are 25 so here we have five twenties are again five five threes are 15 five fours are 20 so this comes out to be three ones are three twos are six so this comes out to be 200 into four which comes out to be 800 okay so the quantity produced by fatima should be equal to 800 i hope i make the calculation right you can check whether i have done the calculation right or not thank you okay so the correct option should be 800 if this does not come out to be the correct one then i have made uh, a disastrous mistake somewhere okay so please uh, let me know if there is any mistake thank you